Good evening. Ignorance is an enemy even to its owner. Welcome to BMC News Live presented by Al Hilal Hospitals and Medical Centers English News. Myself Shana Sultan joining you with the daily news updates. Today's news in detail. His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa emphasized role of Bahraini youth. His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, representative of His Majesty the King for Humanitarian Work and Youth Affairs and chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, emphasized Bahrain's belief in the vital role of its youth in advancing progress and achieving future development goals under the leadership of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa. His Highness highlighted the significant attention given by His Majesty and other Arab leaders to empowering Arab youth, fostering genius understanding, genuine understanding and awareness and enhancing their roles across various sectors to prepare them as future leaders. Parliamentary delegation participated in 8th GCC European Parliamentary Committee meeting. Bahrain Parliamentary Delegation, represented by Sabika Khalifa Al Fadala, Chairman of the Youth Affairs Committee, Adishura Council, participated in the eighth meeting of the GCC European Parliamentary Committee. The meeting discussed the outcomes of the first session of the GCC European Parliamentary Committee team, aimed at identifying updates on topics to be discussed with the European Union. Discussions included the exchange of visits and meetings between the Shura representatives, national and UMA councils of the GCC countries and the European. Parliament. RHF started redirecting Silver Jubilee celebration budgets to charitable organization. In compliance with the directives of His Majesty King Hamad bin Sal Khalifa, the Royal Humanitarian Foundation has started the process of redirecting budgets allocated by official authorities for the Silver Jubilee celebrations of His Majesty's accession to charitable associations and funds. He also commended His Majesty's commitment to, to enhancing principle of community partnership, which reflects his participation and support for the continuous humanitarian efforts undertaken by charitable associations, funds and contributions made by official authorities and community development. Bahrain's Interior Minister commended security cooperation with UAE. General Sheikh Rashid bin Abdul Al Khalifa, Minister of Interior, received a delegation from the Ministry of Interior of the United Arab Emirates yesterday. The meeting with the delegation, led by Colonel Dr. Ali Mubarak Al Zabi, was attended by Sheikh Khalid bin Rashid Al Khalifa, the Director General of Verdict Enforcement and Alternative Sentencing. At the outset of the meeting, the Minister welcomed the delegation's visit to the Kingdom of Bahrain. Now, we shall go for a short commercial break. All your favorite products under one roof in Bahrain from our 14 branches at 27 year old Megamart and Macromart Bakery Fresh meat and fish Fruits and vegetables Sweets and snacks, ready to eat foods. Dairy products, grocery, or consumer goods. To have a wonderful shopping experience, please visit your nearest Megamart Macromart branch. Megamart and Macromart, full of goodness.
Welcome back. Health Minister met delegation from King's College London. Dr. Jalila bin Tal Sayyid Jawad Hassan, the Minister of Health, met with the delegation from King's College London, UK. The meeting was attended by Dr. Sheikh Rana bint Issa bin Taj Al Khalifa, the Director General of the Institute of Public Administration. The Health Minister emphasized the Ministry's commitment to enhancing cooperation with global experts in various programs and academic institutions. Italy's Edna and Stromboli volcanoes erupted, Catania Airport closed. Eruptions at Italy's Mount Etna and the smaller Stromboli volcano spewed hot ash and lava, raising alert levels on the Mediterranean island of Sicily and forcing a temporary shutdown of Catania Airport on Friday. It's now one of the world's most active volcanoes has sent, has seen intense activity in recent days, lightening up the sky near the sky near the city of Catania, while Stromboli of the northern Sicilian coast has spilled lava into the sea. Six arrested over stampede at religious events in India. Indian police said yesterday they have arrested six people over a stampede at a Hindu religious event in the northern state of Uttar Pradesh this week which kill, in which 121 people were killed. The incident occurred on Tuesday in the village of Pulrai Mughal Karhi in Hatras district where about 250,000 people had gathered to listen to preacher Suraj Pal Singh, also known as Bole Baba, organized of the event, had obtained permission for the gathering of only 80 thousand people with this we come to the end of today's news today for daily news updates in bmc news lab english 7 30 pm thank you so much for watching signing off question sultana good night